Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do your April 2019 general reading. So it's a general reading, so it will not resonate with each and every Leo who views the video, but if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated, okay? Um, so someone, either you Leo or someone you're dealing with, you cut something out off you made a final decision about maybe an air sign you feel like your stability is elsewhere you want to start new with you fill in the blank could be job could be love and romance uh, could be family dynamic anyway off camera when I was shuffling that's all I kept getting was someone wanting to start new um, not where they are um, let's see. Somebody who wants to really give it um, a fighting chance somewhere else. So, we'll do three card spread. Past, present, and future. Okay? That cards really want to talk. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Oh. That is really good energy. All right. Okay. My gosh. Okay, so all these cards jumped out in the past. Um, we've got the Four of Swords, the World, and the Devil. So this says... Definitely a karmic cycle has it needs to come to a close or it has come to a close Maybe with an air sign Gemini Libra Aquarius Someone who's ill someone there's like a, a codependent tie here uh, You may have gotten messages via dream dream state that This is I don't really feel as if it's like super toxic it's just more so codependent. Somebody lost themselves within a union, a dynamic, a marriage, a long-standing relationship, a career, a job that just isn't serving them. could be with a Capricorn if you need a sign. It could be with any of the fixed signs. The Leo in the past was in deep thought and meditation about what to do next. Because they, they knew or there was already divorce, separation, something in the works. Currently, you're the five of wands, your energy. Uh... Currently, you're, you're conflicted about something long-standing, a, a, a job, a, a relationship, a marriage, uh, something that was traditional, something that was had um, roots and, and grounding in your life. Definitely, so this could be like a career move. Or this could be a job move. You've been somewhere for a long time. Or this could be a relationship, marriage. It's like, okay, I know what I want. But there's so many moving parts in regards to. Uh, in the near future, you will be the judgment card. The hangman. The queen of pentacles. Um. Some of you are going to have to be final and definite in your judgment surrounding a wife or, or husband. This is a wife. You'll be at the hangman set. Who do you want to be your wife? Who do you want to give that commitment to? Who do you want to be your husband? Or if you're the Leo woman, do you want to continue being someone's wife? 
you're worried about your own stability. It's like someone got lost in regards to this relationship. It's the revival of independence um, and being concerned about your stability, your your own stability, your own money, your own life. Um, now you see something in a different perspective, a different light. Could be dealing with a Piscean person. Doesn't have to be. But we do have the King of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Kind of letting things happen around you. So that's how you'll be in the near future. Let's get uh, maybe... Do some clarifying cards. In the past, the will. Something ended. Like I said, in the past, wow, you got the the world, the devil, and the will. This says your karmic mojo, whatever, whatever karmic crap you were in, it is pretty much over. I mean, you can choose to stay in it, but it's over like you've you you've learned the lesson here whatever the lesson may be let the will of change happen for you let an ending happen so that newness can possibly come let's get one more card for the past and uh, it looks like you've, you've done that or you're at least trying to do that one more card for the past the nine of wands Definitely. Separation. Evaluating a situation from afar. And that's your energy, Nine of Wands. Uh, there's also a, another person, a secret admirer, um, a new boyfriend, a new girlfriend. There's something or someone that came in the midst of um, established relationship uh, that helped you move away from what it is you felt like no longer served you. Okay. There's also possibly separation from this other person. Or there was like um, separation within a dynamic. Um, a marriage. A uh, boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever. Um, we see each other. We may even live with each other. But there's so much distance within this dynamic. It's almost ending. It's almost the Ten of Wands. It's the Nine of Wands. So... Either way, like I said, in the past there is or was an ending. The recent past. Five of Wands. For the present. One second. I gotta. Alright. Five of Wands for the present. Prince of Cups. Yeah. Um, some of you are conflicted about um, moving forward you're not quite out of this dynamic but you still want to offer that cup of love You want to invest emotionally with this other person. Three of Swords. What did I tell you? You're going through divorce and or separation due to infidelity, uh, deception, lies, or cheating. It is, it is what it is. Um, you're also divided. You're di divided because somebody depends on you. And you've been there. You've been dependable. But now it's like, I want to go after what I love and who I love and what I want. My heart is divided by three swords. I'm trying to please the person I'm obligated to, myself, and then this other outside person. 
Okay. Um, this could be a career too. Okay, so in the near future, we have the Judgment card, the Hanging Man, and the Queen of Pentacles. Ten of Swords. Six of Swords, yeah. Okay. Bottom of the deck, Prince of Pentacles. Long time coming. Um, definitely could be dealing with A Cancerian person, either you're walking away, you have Cancer in your chart, you want to go back to a Cancer, uh, it could be anything, right? But you want to offer or you want to accept an offer that you feel as if it's, um, I really feel like this is you giving an offer. It's been a long time because you had to figure out where it is you wanted to go or, or how to maneuver this situation, right? In the near future, you're going to have to make a final judgment about this relationship. You may even be seeing some things clearly or from a different perspective. By way of removing yourself energetically and uh, just allowing things to happen, you know. And you'll be focused more and more concerned on your well-being. Maybe even your health. Ten of Swords. Six of Swords. Some of you definitely walking away from air sign. Or walking to an air sign. I don't know. Complete ending. It's over. It's done. You know. Whatever. Uh, it. it I can't keep going like this. It it's over. It's done. It there's no more fight in this. Six of Swords says, "Yeah, I want to move on to peace, serenity. I, I choose peace because the sixes are about choices. The the choice." Queen of Wands and the Queen of Wild. Wow, Queen of Wands and Queen of Pentacles. Something about um, going after your heart's desire, taking action on what or who you desire. Worried about stability for yourself, Queen of Pentacles, and those around you. Worried about the home and the 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 tangible the queens are always worried about uh their element some of you is, is lack of passion within an old dynamic and you're wanting to um, be more passionate charismatic outgoing within a new dynamic and you're choosing to be centered and focused on uh, creativity uh, vitality, motivation. Some of you could be more connected to spirit. Uh, some of you could have tarot card reading businesses. This is like a person who's also concerned about, you know, getting very concerned or doing a lot of work in regards to what it is you're, you you um, have a lot of passion about, what your heart's desire in regards to. Um, your stability also so it's like yes I like to garden but how do I make this a career or how do I make how do I turn this into money for myself how how do I make this foundational some of you are, it's definitely a, a career change and some of you it's relationship the world again we're getting some of the repeating cards Cycle has ended for my Leo. Uh, let's see what the Angel Answers cards have to say. It's 
some of you are dealing with water signs you can't sometimes you feel like you can't read them emotionally they uh you're very good at holding emotion um you feel like exes are still around them you feel like they get a lot of attention um yeah Thank you, Lord, for blessing these cards with the messages for my Leo. No, there's like 10 cards. Let's see. What can we tell our Leos? Okay, we got a timeline within the next few weeks. Within the next few weeks. Within the next few weeks, you're going to have to make a judgment. Yeah, helpful people. Helpful people around you. You feel like you're going through this all about perfect timing. You have to understand that timing is everything. All right. Don't stop and wait. All right. Bottom of the deck. Choose a new direction. Looks like some of you are doing that. Um, I will clarify just one of these cards. I want to know within the next few weeks. What is this about? Within the next few weeks. What's happening with my Leos? The energy was pretty calm. You know, it was just pretty much. ending happened this is the first reading i've done with in the retrograde that i don't see a whole bunch of people coming back more so leo getting rid of people who don't belong right within the next few weeks within the next few weeks within the next few weeks Five of Pentacles, yeah. There'll be a lot of change in regards to long-standing dynamics, marriages, career, corporations, religious sectors. You will either dismiss yourself from those or you'll feel cut out or you'll have to cut someone else out. Eight of Wands in reverse. Yeah, something's not... You're going to decide to not move something along wow and then the death card at the bottom of the day so this is pretty telling um leo's done here i know to say right leo if you feel like this reading resonated with you for you Please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Um, looks like some good energy is coming in for you. Especially once you just do it. This looks like a whole bunch of doing. You know? Uh, once you just start to do. Spirit is 100% behind you. Just do. You know? For it is for us to do the possible. It is for God to do the impossible. So don't get too wrapped up in what you feel is impossible. Just do the possible, okay? Uh, Leo, know that I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys. Talk to you soon.